Hey, what's up? John again. Uh, hope you got to fill out some things on your archive of awesome uh, with that email I sent out yesterday. So have you ever felt like you don't deserve the success you've achieved or like you're a fraud and people are going to find out in this house of cards that you've built your life upon is going to come crashing down because people are going to realize maybe you're not as competent, smart, um, thorough, you know, pick anything out as you're portrayed to be. Well, guess what, my friends, that is imposter syndrome. And I want you to know that you are not alone in those feelings. Um, it, at some point in their lives, it can affect up to 70% up to of people have felt like that. You know, probably on a daily basis, I'd say it's probably closer more to 20%. Um, but if you feel like that, you're in good company because guess what? Usually only high achievers have these feelings of being an imposter. Uh, people like Maya Angelou, uh, the writer, uh, uh, legendary actor Tom Hanks, and um, especially me. And I'm going to give you a little bit of my background uh, with imposter syndrome. So uh, as soon as I got out of college for the next 15 years, I led field test operations uh, across the planet for NASA, Department of Defense, and Homeland Security projects. Um, the teams that I was a part of and that I led, we received um, numerous accolades, but I never really believed I deserved them, contrary to the proof of whatever it was we were working on being out in the world and doing the thing. Um, so I know how exhausting and demoralizing it can be to continually feel like you're not good enough and you're living behind this facade. And if people only knew the real you, um, they would, you know, they, they would turn around. And like I said, this house of cards that you feel like you're you've built your entire life will come tumbling down. Um, imposter syndrome is a thief. It robs us of our most, most precious commodity and one that we can never get back. And that is our time. So it might be stealing more time than you ever realize in ways you maybe never thought of. So hope you, uh, enjoy tomorrow's email where I get dig in to help you uncover a little bit how imposter syndrome might be showing up in your life and you're not even realizing it. See you tomorrow.